was set before Seth was set. Really? Like Randy used to have long hair and a beard? Man, what Booker meant is these two had a very similar paths, okay? They were both part of groundbreaking factions. They were both Mr. Money in the Bank. They were both the face of the authority. And they're both among the greatest to ever step foot in a... Seth Rollins going for the cover. Architect trying to end this thing early. He wasn't even close on that pin attempt. He turns it around. Being carried around with ease. Yeah. An uncanny showing of power. Nasty stop to finish it off. It's the reversal. No, 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 that'll break his arm. Vicious. Randy Orton has been at this for almost two decades, and he's still in his prime. He still has the deadliest move in all of WWE. The RKO. The legend killer needs to keep his head on the swivel when it comes to Seth Rollins. The Kingslayer has such a versatile set of moves, and Orton needs to know the perfect moment to catch Rollins in an RKO out of nowhere. Answers back on Orton. Oh, kick right in the back. Oh, right across the solar plexus. Great reversal. Here we go. Converted DDT by Belly. He's getting a little battered now. He planned for this and could still rally. And Rollins capitalizes. Hoist it up into the snap suplex. Rollins have planned here. Boom! Small package driver. Oh, so athletic. No, oh, no, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Spinning kick to the gut. Set Rollins. Oh, what a super kick from the architect. Despicable menacing. Left by the turnbuckles. Not where you want to be right now. Absolutely not. Randy, what are you doing? Orton, oh no. No way. This isn't over yet. Oh, no, 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 that'll break his arm. Vicious. Oh, my goodness. There's the... Rear chin lock, and now just rapid fire punches. Looking for a high risk move. Incoming. Lining it up. Stop. That just put down the Viper. Makes a cover. Two. Three. No. A two count. Amazing. An unbelievable showing of tenacity from Orton to manage the kick out. Rollins is starting to lose his temper. He needs to put that aside and refocus. You have to sense that fatigue is starting to become a factor at this point. Make no illusions of it. This is coming down to a battle of attrition. 
Gotta find a way to get out of this. Have you ever seen a human being tossed like that? That kick will stop you in your tracks. Cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. But tonight, he was the prey for Seth freaking Rollins. And there's sure to be plenty of bedlam on tap for this Extreme Rules matchup. These superstars have nothing but bad intentions in mind for each other. And they have everything and everywhere at their disposal to annihilate one another. And he sends him into the corner. Oh. And like a pawn and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. Did you see that? Propelled through the air. Big elbow. And finds a counter. Line. Good grief. Everything is legal in an Extreme Rules match. What does a superstar have to do to adapt to a situation like this? Exactly what you said, Cole. Adapt. To walk out on top of an Extreme Rules match, a superstar has to change themselves and tap into that dark side of their psyche. Oh, oh that'll break his arm. Vicious. Stomping. Ouch. Some miscues from Shawn Michaels here. Yeah, but he expected extreme pain in an Extreme Rules match. That's a nasty cut on Shawn Michaels. Face first. Come on, right the jaw. Oh, what a shot. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, strikes with the back elbow. He's going for the pin. One, two. Only a two count. He tried to make quick work of things and almost succeeded. This is just ridiculous. Look at the power. This is downright superhuman. Dead whip, gut wrench suplex. Cena is showing zero restraint. Tough night so far for Michaels. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh, right across the throat. Michaels turns that around. Michaels is not taking this line down anymore. Could be the table turner Sean desperately needed. What a shot. That'll break his arm. Vicious. What a shot. Just like that, Cena gets intercepted. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. It's like I always say, he who has the sledgehammer has the last laugh. Into the ring. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. To the outside. This could get wild. Tagged with a punch. Hoist it up. He's looking a little off balance. Sledgehammer connects. That will scramble your insides. 
sometimes. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. Elbow drop right on point. And Cena starting to falter here. Few can match the pace that Shawn Michaels sets. Quick return to the ring. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. of that trademark staying power that John Cena possesses. And Michaels is so used to any matches like this. Tonight is not going to be an easy one for HBK. Oh, oh man. The pace is quick and courtesy of Shawn Michaels. Cena needs to find some energy fast. Oh, Kid out, guys. Michaels refuses to concede this fight. And Cena has to hammer down now. He was only inches away from gaining the three count. Oh. You gotta wonder if Michaels can fight his way back into this. Cena! Oh. Michaels down. Needs to snap back into this. celebration after a match like that. Hey, it could have been worse for HBK. <laughs> At least he didn't lose his smile. Would you stop? This is a match where these WWE superstars take it to the max, to the extreme. There are no rules. As an agent of chaos myself, I've always had a little bit of a soft spot in my heart for extreme rules. Oh, there's no question that extreme rules is in a category all by itself. Well, some people look forward to Halloween. Some look forward to New Year's Eve. Me, personally, I look forward to every extreme rules match on our show. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Reckless abandon being shown and paying off as well. Stomp right to the gut. Added pressure afterwards. Ugh. Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. Fishing for something beneath the ring. I definitely do not want to be in his path of destruction. Paul gets out of the way. Oh, the kendo stick wrapped around their head. How does one best take advantage of the extreme rules environment? Quite simply, if you can dream it, you can do it. This isn't the time to be timid. This is the time to leave it all in the ring. Across the top rope, what a hot shot. He's taking this to the floor now. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. Right in the kisser. He gets out of the way. Sheamus dodges that one. 
he'll head to the ring. Hoist it up. Oh, gut buster. Evisceration. Oh, shoulder, elbow, all affected with that. Seated knee strike. Yeah. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Oh, enough already. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. and does. Golly, that sounded rough. And Sheamus is countered. Boom, what a punch. So here we go, Extreme Rules, basically anything goes. You can win by pinfall or submission. Every hold, every surface, every object in the arena is all fair game for these combatants. Ouch. Oh.
Targeting the net! Snapbreaker! Corey, what are the perils of this match that superstars must be concerned with? Well, this is the type of setting where you must be aware of outside interference because when it's no disqualification, it's not considered interference. It's legal. The match can change in an instant when another individual who is not officially part of the match makes their presence felt. That's when a competitor needs to utilize the anything goes stipulation to their benefit and eliminate the mismatch. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Goldberg fights that. Concerned about anyone else's well being. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. Part of the territory when you're in an extreme rules match, Cole. He had it scouted. Goldberg able to dodge that. Body slam. Sliding back into the action. Getting back into the ring. Vader escapes the attack. And he's able to beat Goldberg to the punch. Oh, no. Stun gun. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. a baseball bat, hoping to end this match with one big swing. Pull up a roundhouse. Up the counter. There he goes, right into the corner. Gentlemen, I feel like this match will be over in about five seconds. I think you're right, Corey. Vader, ready to go in. Looking for the high risk. to wipe out the cobwebs and find the upper hand? I thought it was over. The WWE Universe thought it was over. But you gotta do a little more to finally finish this. What a reversal by Goldberg. Uncorks a thunderous chop. So accurate.
When you go to The Rock, this is a superstar who, it seems, was always earmarked for greatness. Not surprising, considering he was the first third-generation WWE superstar, but you also have to respect that The Rock lived up to that height. Rock's never been afraid to prove himself in this industry. I'm sure he'll prove here tonight that he's still one of the greats. On the other end, we have Riddle and the high expectations and hype he brought when he first entered WWE. Everyone was so excited to see what he was capable of, and so far, Riddle's skill level has been even higher than anticipated. Oh, and Riddle goes for a quick ride. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Submission maneuver coming. This will win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage. And he very quickly counters. All right, back to it. Returning to the ring. Given his potent combination of strength, speed, agility, and stamina, Riddle really is a gifted hybrid athlete. How does that come into play in his matches? Well, a combination of all those physical gifts you just mentioned, Cole, and versatility. Riddle just has to find one area where he has the upper hand over his opponent in order to succeed. Oh, that right there is classic rock. Flip over into the DDT. Going up top. Gut suplex. the shoulder in jeopardy there. Stomping down. Headed up. He's thinking back. Oh. And Rock gets reversed. Bad predicament right here. Straight impact on the throat. Find a way out. Several light hands, and he's out. Oh, what a nice kick. Nice takedown. Riddle's preparing something. Just waylaid the rock. Oh, he gets out. Perhaps some renewed life in him now. Ooh. He's absorbing some tough hits now. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. just defied odds with that kick out. Everyone thought this was over. The Rock reformulating his game plan. It was not enough to end this, so he'll have to move on to plan B. Up high! That's gotta be it! Two! Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. I am in shock. What's it gonna take to keep this guy down?
to end it all. Swings in momentum. Every push has been cut off. just overwhelming him here. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Great awareness from Riddle. Oh. Gut rat suplex. Extreme Rules match. It's hard to predict what will happen, but there will be chaos. I can assure you of that. The thing I love about Extreme Rules is we're guaranteed something from out of the blue. Some outside interference, a weapon nobody saw coming. Oh, uh, who are you kidding, Corey? You just love all this anarchy, don't you? Confession. Guilty as charged. How's that for a counter? Caught with a punch. And he's able to counter. Up and down, what a gourd buster. Undertaker tied up here. Oh, what a deep. He goes to the quick pen attack. He throws a shoulder up before two. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. Oh, foot just stomping down. And set him up. Oh, and even the ace. That's going to hurt. Undertaker retaliates. Ooh, body shot. Put into the corner now. Yeah. Oh, look at this aggression in the corner. Yeah. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? The measured elbow drop. Undertaker looking mortal here. Now, this is the kind of match where you can really push the bounds of damage you can inflict. I'm not saying that a no disqualification match should mean carte blanche to do whatever you want to someone, but it does provide an opening to be creative in your offense. So, be creative. Unbelievable. Uh oh, I shudder to think what this is all about. I assure you, this is not on my run sheet. You can't push the game that far without getting some retaliation. Now, thanking the cerebral assassin. He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. He's got that glint in his eye, that sadistic look that only comes when ladders enter the equation. And back in the ring we go. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Tough position to be caught in here. Taking it outside the ring now. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? It is locked in. STF applied. Is there a way out of this STF? Yes, there is. A couple elbows will do the job. Makes him pay with a counter. 
Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Yes, he didn't come here to let him boast and talk. And full control here. Face for a turnbuckle. Up on the turnbuckle now. Return fire for the Undertaker. Ooh, body shot. Well, great counter impressive ring IQ on display there. Way. The Belay looking to end this match. The Undertaker in a bad way. Two count. Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. Amazing kick out from The Undertaker. His resilience tonight is unreal. And Triple H is now realizing he has a different breed of opponent here tonight. The game is going to have to pull stops the close from this end. He's absorbed some damage already. Hardy oh, stays ahead of Triple H. If the Undertaker got my heel in there, how about we take things a little old school? Yeah, I like it. And he's taking this to the outside now. Like I always say, he who has the sledgehammer has the last lap. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. And Triple H had that started. He saw it coming, taking advantage. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Just launched. Two of the toughest. Men. Both arms hooked. I agree. That's the game changer. Looking for the victory. Two. Three. And a win. Here is your winner, the game. Triple H. The game kept fighting with all his strength, with all his defiance, until the dead man had absolutely nothing left. What an amazing struggle between two all-time greats. The person... The bell is rung on this Extreme Rules match. Not the type of match for people with a weak constitution to participate in or to witness. Are you sure you're going to be all right for this one, Saxton? I'm okay for now. I'll put my eyes when things get ugly. Oh, hammering clotheslines. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with his heart. Targeting the shoulder with the club. Escape and a takedown. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm. He avoids the damage. Two-handed choke slam. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Turns that around. Two hands. Choke slam sends them crashing. Stop in the leg. Oh no, he can be caught here. Bad spot for him. On his stomach. Boston crab. Boston. The crab locked in. Nice counter. For a speedy pinfall there. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. God. Enough already. Really just laying it in. Boom, right in the button. Oh, that was just.
just malicious. Insulting. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Reigns comes up short on that attack. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Out of the ring, what's his plan here? Oh, jeez. The Ultimate Warrior has run right into trouble. A rare situation to see Warrior slow down. Attack to the midsection. He'll take things into the ring. Gets inside the ring. Counters! And Warrior needed that badly. He's showing it's not time for lying down. It's time for fighting. Whoa! Uh-oh, he's searching for something. I guess he thinks the one thing missing in this match is a steel chair. Reigns had that scouted. Sequence of reversals there. The big dog still has some fight left. And Warrior has to be asking the heavens, is it time to step aside? Do I have what it takes to defeat this man? Taking flight. Reigns gets out of hard play. Kravat sinks in. He's in complete control. Opponent has no Submitted. He let it go. Does he get out here? One, two. Oh, what a kick out. Don't turn out the lights just yet. The electricity has been cut. The warrior slowed to a stop. The head of the table cinches it in. DT required. I'm not quite sure if this man shouldn't tap out. This is about career lunge. He gets up a strong victory. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns! Cementing their name after that match. Definitely earning those accolades with that win. The Roman Empire grows as Reigns continues to conquer his opposition. Over the years, we've seen a lot in Extreme Rules matches. Forklifts, spears to the announce table, brawls moving into the crowd. Always a great time. One thing I've learned over the years, Michael, is blink as little as possible. If you do, you might miss a historic moment in this one. Well, I've learned that you got to keep your head on the swivel because more often than not, someone's getting thrown our way. Oh, just turn that around. Oh, check out this pop. He takes control. Face first with a waistlock takedown. Producing a trampling. Oh, oh he That's going to hurt. Yeah. Strikes with a kick. Ooh, a sharp kick. There's some power behind that punch. Lashley in a jam here. Looking for the quick 10. And only a one count. Impressive one count, but still very early. Lashley out of the way. Oh, man, check out this power. Ah! Gorilla press slam. Oh, it dropped. 
Just deadlifting right there. The power. Superhuman. Austin with a reversal. Notice complications has to benefit a certain type of superstar more than others, doesn't it, Corey? Get off your high horse, Cole. And no disqualification not benefits the superstar who's smarter, faster, and better. Using the rules to your advantage doesn't make you the villain here. Oh, look at this. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. And not only may be planning to turn this match into his very own home run derby. Oh, man. Lashley avoids impact. Way. Boom. And he barely avoids. A kendo stick wrapped around the head. Reversal on top of reversal. DDT. Oh, God, that hurt. This match is brutality starting to show on him. In order to succeed in an extreme rules match, you have to be willing to sacrifice your body a bit, guys. Great trouble here. Can he get a full lock in? threw all of his strength into that last maneuver and it still did not produce dividends. Oh boy, come on, not the chair. Stone Cold in some serious trouble. Crumble at the feet of the Almighty. You have to think these competitors expected this to be a difficult challenge. Even so, at this stage, things just get more and more dangerous. Fatigue starts setting in and you don't know exactly how... in that endless tank of his to get the shoulder up. And you've got to wonder if desperation starts to kick in for Stone Cold. Stone Cold with a Is there any air left in the Two, three. Steve Austin picks up a strong victory. Crack a few Steve Weisers, Cole. Byron, you stay here. Austin 316 says he just won this match. Throughout history, there have been laws and rules to keep society moving. Tonight, no such thing. And that's the way we like it, Cole. No rules, just raw power and straight up anarchy. It takes a certain kind of superstar to thrive in the chaotic atmosphere of extreme rules. Now you're right, Byron. It helps if you have a screw loose. <laughs> you said it, not me. Speaking of having a couple of screws loose, I think I'm going a little nuts myself working alongside you two. 
Body shots over and over. One to the jaw and then, whoa! This is just brute power. Oh my goodness, absolute dominance. Ooh, Van Damme avoids contact. Springboard misses the target. Front face lock applied. It's about to get more painful. Hung across the top rope. Cover here. And a good strong kick out there. Not enough to get past the one count yet. Avoiding contact. The stretch mufflers in. Couple of kicks will break it. He decides. Jeez. Oh, not quite what Brock intended. Oh, man. Right on the mark. Good night. Oh, he knew what was coming. this to the outside now. Outside the ring now. He has no need to rush. Malicious fall away slam. And Dan saves himself. Roundhouse That was nasty. Back into the ring. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. He's been kicked in midsection. He's lost some of his win now. Just pure instinct at this point. RVD! Oh, and Dan was just about to finish this. And he's still in the game. I think Paul Heyman's heart just skipped the beat. Was that a wake-up call out for Brock Lesnar? Has it just angered the beast more? What's the tally on how many times we thought this match was coming to an end? I can't count anymore. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. You establish dominance. No! Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Leather with a waist lock. I think we're about to take a trip, gentlemen. This is where Brock Lesnar is at home. And there's the cover. We're reaching a point where these superstars must be hurt, must be vulnerable. And who's going to find a way to capitalize on that vulnerability? Lesnar fuses short, ready to explode. Byron, grab your little dog and or your aunt. Five. Bad spot for RVD. Cover. Two. Three. Brock Lesnar has done it. Here is your winner, Brock. victory for him in this match. That was a dominating showing where we saw the beast Brock Lesnar just annihilate his opponent. That's what Brock does best.